I've been getting some comments lately on my YouTube videos with regards to vitamin A toxicity when taking desiccated beef organ supplements or just eating organ meats in general. Rather than answering each individual comment, I wanted to film this video to provide you with some peace of mind. So when you're eating organs, you're getting a large amount of biologically active vitamin A, which is a fat soluble vitamin. This means that any unneeded vitamin A by the body can be stored in your fat cells for later use. However, it could also build up the toxic levels more easily as compared to a water-soluble vitamin, such as vitamin C or all the B vitamins. So why am I not worried about vitamin A toxicity? That's because vitamin A and vitamin D compete with one another. Specifically, vitamin A interferes with vitamin D activity, which is why if you're not getting enough vitamin D, but ingesting large amounts of vitamin A, you could worsen a vitamin D deficiency. That means that a lot of negative reports in vitamin A toxicity ignore the fact that vitamin D balances out vitamin A. If you have optimal amounts of vitamin D, consuming organ meats shouldn't be a concern. But, and this is a big one, if you're not getting enough sunlight and are not eating enough wild caught salmon and or not supplementing with vitamin D every day, then I will seriously worry if you are ingesting large amounts of vitamin A. I personally take ancestral supplements, desiccated beef organ supplements, but I also make sure I take 5,000 I use of vitamin D every day. I will link to these supplements in the description box below. I also urge you to watch my vitamin D supplement video, which will also be linked below. The video delves deeper into what dosage might be right for you, and it goes over what your blood levels of vitamin D need to be at for optimal health. And if you're like me and you would like to nerd out some more on vitamin A toxicity, I have linked a paper in the description box below that delves deeper into this topic. All right. I hope this helped and if it did make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe and hit that notification bell so youtube alerts you every time i post a new video thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one